Hi, this is Digital Stereo Guitar. We're checking out the song Be Thou My Vision, the cover song by the band Citizens and Saints. Very easy guitar part. Generally, it is just a bass and a keyboard riff throughout the whole way, but then there is a slight guitar part just played over and over and over again in different parts of the song. We're just going to go through that part. Very straightforward. Pick up your guitar and let's give it a shot. So the song is in the key of G, very straightforward. Just in the nicely in the key of G. The very first note on that riff is a high B. So as you probably know, you got a low B. You can also play the B here. And we're playing it an octave higher. Okay, so we're starting on the ninth fret of the third string down, which is a D string. We've also got a few delays on there, a couple of delays lapping over each other. One of them is just constantly on, the other one is in tap tempo to the song itself. Okay, and the riff goes like this. And then you loop it again. Very straightforward. So again, if we do it with a single finger from that nine, okay. And then we're going up to the seventh of the fourth string. Okay. And then we go from the seventh fret of the second string down, down to the fifth fret of the second string as well. And I, instead of doing a single finger, I like to just alternate, yeah? Now what you'll notice is when I'm playing it, I'm using my first finger and my ring finger, and then when I go down to the next string, I use my middle finger just because I like to have that previous note sort of fading in the background. As opposed to going like that, where the previous note is gonna cut out. So I like to have them both sort of inter interwoven there. Okay, so very slowly with the two fingers. Okay, second guitar is just a, we'll say an acoustic guitar. I can play this on electric as well. We're just going through the basic chords of the song, which is G. And then when we go into the second chorus, heart of my own heart, we go down to an E minor. to B, a G, sorry, and then to a C, or a C here. But I like to play it in a similar G shape. And then E minor. We like, I like to generally put a bit of distortion on the last one, which is slightly bigger. So just a bit of an overdrive. And that is basically the song. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for a whole bunch of more videos.